Hello and welcome to this video. It's Leonard here from DetailLearner.com and in today's video tutorial, we are going to look at Binance P2P trading. Alright, so what I'm going to show you in this video is everything you need to know about the Binance P2P trading platform and how you can start making money from it on a daily basis. Okay, so if you are new to the channel, you love videos about making money online, about crypto trading investing, then consider subscribing. Hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time videos like this are published and if you do gain value from this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up okay if you want to learn more about crypto and join my weekly zoom meeting then link to join the telegram group will be in the video description all right so with that being said let's jump right into it now in order for you to be able to operate the binance p2p platform you need a binance account okay not just a binance account you need a verified binance account so if you don't have an account already use the link in the video description or in the comment section to sign up for an account all right and once you sign up for an account okay it's very easy to get your account verified just use your bvn if you're in nigeria use your bvn you don't need to upload anything with your bvn you can get your binance account verified it's as simple as that okay so once you get your account verified then you can go ahead and start trading and making money on the binance p2p trading platform okay if you want to jump to specific chapters of this video i have put you know a time code in the video description you can just go ahead so that you don't waste the, you know your time watching the video from the beginning to the end but if you need to learn everything i'm going to show you here then you can see the video from the beginning to the end else just use the time code and jump to the appropriate chapters that you want to actually you know take a look at to be able to help you all right so with that being said let's get back to the business what is binance p2p all right but before i go into that i'm going to do all of the demonstration using the binance web version or the desktop version okay but everything i'm going to show you here can be done using the binance uh, mobile app okay so to access the binance p2p trading platform on the desktop or the web version i'll just come in here to where it says once you log into your account come in here to where it says buy crypto and then we'll go ahead and click on p2p trading So once we click on P2P trading, it brings us to the Binance P2P trading platform. Okay, this is where we are going to carry out our buying, our selling, and our making money all on the Binance P2P. Okay, on this platform. So what is Binance P2P? Binance P2P, if you're in Nigeria, is the easiest way and the only way you can convert your Naira into crypto and then convert your crypto into naira into your bank account directly okay so it's only through the binance p2p so the p2p um is actually a way uh, it means you can buy crypto okay binance uh, uh, provides an opportunity for you to buy crypto using your fiat currency your local currency your naira your Ghanaian cds whatever um country you are you can easily use your local currency to buy crypto and then equally through the p2p platform you can sell your crypto to your bank account directly okay so that is basically the summary of what p2p is all about so if i'm in nigeria and i want to buy um usdt i can come in here to the binance p2p platform click on the buy icon here and then i can buy with all of these different prices there then if i want to sell you know um, crypto to my bank account i come in here to the sell option and then i can see all of the different prices listed here and i can sell to anybody that i want to sell to okay so that is basically what p2p is all about and on the binance trading platform um, on the binance p2p trading platform i can buy or sell usdt with my naira i can buy or sell uh, btc busd bnb ethereum and so on okay so these are all the supported tokens that i can buy directly using my naira or sell directly to my bank account using the binance p2p trading platform okay so before we go further let us look at few advantages why you want to consider using p2p and most especially on the binance platform okay trading on the number one is trading on the binance platform um does not require you paying fee it's zero fee you're not paying any fee to either the merchant or the person you are buying from or selling to or to binance so you trade here with zero fee so another advantage of using the binance um p2p trading platform is that you have access to multiple 
payment method you can do bank transfer you can use cheaper cash you can use any of these okay all of these different payment methods are according to the country you are okay if i go ahead and select a different let's say i want to do usd okay a different currency here yeah? meaning that i'm selling you know countries where i can accept usd to my bank account directly and the rest okay you have multiple payment methods you see here okay you see you have all of these different payment methods if if i'm in ghana for instance if i want to sell in ghana i can go ahead and you know select the um ghana cities okay then you equally get just go ahead when you get this prompt okay just go ahead and confirm that okay check and confirm that so you equally get different payment method that you can actually you know sell to all right so let me come back to ngn because that is where i am i'm in nigeria so everything i'll be doing with the nigeria era okay so um you have different payment method you can accept okay whether it is bank transfer western union whatever it is okay um cash app anything at all you want to use here okay bank of america anything at all if it is any of these payment method you want to accept you can go ahead and use them all right so another advantage of using the binance p2p trading platform is that transaction here are as fast as anything okay you have though binance gives you 15 minutes okay between you and the person you be transacting from to execute that transaction but believe me for all of the time i've used this platform i've completed my transaction or get paid whatever i'm buying whatever i'm buying from within in less than that 15 minutes okay in less than 15 minutes so transaction here are very fast so you don't need to you know be afraid of anything and why you want to still consider using binance p2p is because you don't need to start looking for somebody to buy crypto from and then maybe after sending money the person will not send you the crypto but on binance it is guaranteed and you know why it is guaranteed it is because of the binance escrow service okay so another advantage of using the platform is the binance escrow service now what the escrow stands for is that if i want to buy crypto from this person okay you see um this person is still limited meaning that i can't buy from this person if i want to buy from this person for instance um the limit here is that this person is selling from 62,000 to about 62 okay let's say i want to buy from this person i click on buy and then i type in let me just buy everything here okay so the 62,000 here will give me um approximately um that is it will give me roughly 104 dollars 50 cent this is what i'm going to get in usdt okay this is what i'm going to get in usdt now once i place um i click on this buy usdt automatically what the binance escrow service does is that it will automatically remove this 104 usdt from this person's account this person will not be able to withdraw that money until my transaction with the person is completed okay so once i finish making payment okay once i finish making payment to the person's account um, bank account i just go ahead and click on i have paid all right so once i click on i have paid i will walk you through that once i click on i have paid binance will prompt this person okay that i'm buying from that i have made payment the person will have no option than to approve it okay if for any reason the person denies that he or she has not received my payment then i can send a screenshot to binance and binance take it off from there if they are certain that yes i truly made that payment the crypto will be returned to you so you don't need to be afraid that oh what if i send the money and the person will not send the the the, the crypto no the person can't do that binance is already in possession of this crypto and they will definitely send that crypto your way so you don't need to be afraid that is why i recommend that everybody um, who wants to either convert naira to crypto or crypto to naira uses the binance p2p trading platform all right the same thing happens when you want to sell okay in this case you are the one selling let's say you want to sell to this person once you click on sell you go ahead and add the amount of usdt you want to sell once you add the amount of usdt you want to sell automatically binance you know um through the escrow service you know grabs that usdt that you want to sell and you know put it in their possession okay with the escrow service meaning that after the person makes payment the person will confirm that he or she has made payment to your account it is not left for you to go ahead and click on and you have received the payment um release crypto okay and then the person's crypto will be released to him 
But if you don't, the person will just upload bank, you know, proof of payment. And once Binance goes through it and see that it is right, they will just approve the money to the person. So you cannot cheat anybody on the Binance P2P track, uh, platform. Neither will anybody cheat you on the Binance P2P platform because of the escrow, the Binance escrow service. All right. So the next thing I want us to equally look at is these three tabs. Okay, these are the three ways you can either buy, sell um, crypto using the Binance P2P. You can use the express mode, you can use the P2P, you can use the block mode. Okay, what are the difference? Now on the P2P, let me start with the P2P. On the P2P, when you come in here, you need to individually search for the person you want to buy from. Okay, so when I come in here, let's say I want to buy crypto worth um, 20,000 Naira. Okay. If I come in here, this first person, though I can't buy because this person is limited, it means that um, I can't buy from this person. Okay, if I come to the next person here, I, this person is only, only, only ready to sell from 1,000 um, to 1,000. Okay, so um, I can't buy from this person. This person is ready to sell from 62,000 to 62,000. I cannot buy from this person. This person is ready to sell from 77 to 77 i can't buy from this person so i will need to keep searching for the person okay okay here i can buy this person is from one twenty uh, from 1000 to twenty five thousand. so my twenty thousand worth of crypto i can buy from this person all right so i can buy from this person i just click on buy and i go ahead and buy the same thing applies to sell if i want to sell and i want to sell crypto worth twenty thousand i will need to search and look for somebody who can buy anything from 20,000 upward okay like this person that is selling from oh this is 5 million I can't buy from this person okay this is 5 million to 50 million so I cannot sell to this person this is 5 million to 50 million 7 million to 40 million 20 million and above so with the P2P you need to continually search for the person that has the limit of that particular um, uh, worth of crypto that you want to sell okay if you don't get it then you continue to search and go to the next page the next page until you find somebody that you can sell to okay in order to save you this headache okay there are two ways you can go about it in order to save you this headache of searching for who you want to buy from the specific amount you have or who you want to sell to in order to save you this headache you can come in here to the express mode okay so um, i'll come to the express mode so one way to go about that is i can come in here and click and add here to filter that i can just come in here and add twenty thousand here okay let's say i want to buy twenty thousand so i just go ahead and add twenty thousand and then click on search okay so automatically it will search that range so you see that this person is from eleven thousand to twenty five fifteen thousand to five hundred okay um 20 um to 192 so here you can just go ahead and click on sell or just click on buy to buy from that person okay that is one way to go about that and then the second way will now bring us to the express mode if i come in here to the express mode all right so once i come in here to the express mode okay um i don't need to start searching for who i want to buy from or who i want to sell to all i just need to do is to enter the amount and binance does the session for me automatically okay so i just enter the amount i want to buy and then click on buy with zero fee or i enter the amount i want to sell and then click on sell with zero fee and binance will automatically search for the person you 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 are the next available um verified trader and then you just go ahead and provide you with the bank details you go ahead and make payment to that uh, bank details and the rest okay so that is how you use the binance you know buy and sell the express mode to buy and sell on the binance p2p all right and the last platform here is the block trade mode on the binance p2p okay um here what it simply means is if you want to trade high volumes okay if you want to sell crypto world millions of naira you use the block trade okay here you can see that it's from 5 million to 500 million okay 5 million to 580 million so you see even if you want to buy billions of naira worth of crypto okay people are ready here who want to sell that to you okay so the block trade is for high volume traders okay um let's say you want to sell bitcoin worth 500 million naira you just come in here to the block trade platform and you can see available verified okay they are all verified okay 
and um, they are all verified see these are all advanced traders so you can just come in here and sell and then wire the money to your bank account live and direct all right so that is what the block trade so these are the three different ways you can buy sell crypto using the binance p2p trading platform all right so the other way i want to show you let's say you want to sell crypto to your bank account first you need to add bank account details on the binance account okay so to do that if i click on where it says more Okay, you see where it says payment method. I'll go ahead and click on payment method. So once I click on payment method here, it allows us to add payment method. You can add multiple payment method. Okay. Um, you can add, for instance, um, those who want to go into uh, P2P arbitrage trading. Let's say you have an account in South Africa. You have an account in Ghana. Um, in as much as they all carry your name the name you verified your binance account with you can add them up here meaning that you can transact with those account details or those bank, bank account details with some of this country while you are in your own location where you are all right so i can have you know uh, one bank account you can add as many account details as you want okay um, you can add uh, you know um, uba you can add a first bank you can add all of those but if you want to start doing arbitrage trading then you can add different account in as much as you have account in these countries okay you can buy for instance crypto in the us and then you come to nigeria and sell it in as much as you have those accounts you can do all of that using this is where you add okay just click on add payment method and then you click on if you want to add more you just click on more okay you see all of the different payment method that you can accept all right so um you see all of the different payment method you can choose from but i prefer bank transfer so you click on bank transfer and then when you click on bank transfer automatically this name cannot be changed so the account details you are going to add here must you know um go a rhyme with the name you verified your binance account with okay so you just go ahead and add the account number the bank name all right all of these details and then you go ahead and confirm once you confirm that put in you know verify uh, follow the two-factor authenticator and verify it and the account will be added on your um, binance account okay so whenever you come in here to sell crypto once you click on sell and you put in the amount you want to sell, automatically Binance shows your um, account details to the person who is buying from you. They make the transfer to your account details and then you, from your end, you just go ahead and release the crypto. Okay, that is how that one works. Okay, so they send you the money from your end. You just go ahead and release the crypto to them. Um, it's as simple as that. All right. So now, how do you make money with the Binance um, P2P trading platform? Now let me show you something if we come in here to the p2p and we click on buy okay this person is ready to sell at 600 603 603 and it goes on like that for one usdt we won't come in here and click on sell okay you see that the sell option here is from this is person is ready to sell 608 604 603 36 okay this is 603 36 um naira 36 kobo Okay, if I come in here, what is the lowest we got from the buy option? Okay, we got 600 and this person is just 1,000. It's not even selling. Okay, so you see the lowest here is 603.45 Kobo. So there is difference between, you know, some Kobos in, in Kobos actually. Okay, so here you are getting 607. Where is that 603? 603.40 Kobo. <laughs> okay, 603.36 Kobo. So 603.35 Kobo and it goes on that way. All right. So the more you go down, the lower the offer becomes. Why on the sell buy tab, the more you go lower, the higher the offers become. So these people who are selling it, when you sell to these people here, they in turn come back to the buy option and place the ad to sell back to you. So when you want to buy, you buy higher from them. And when you want to sell, you sell lower to them. So this is one way people make money from this platform. Okay, anybody can post ad here in as much as you have a verified Binance account. To post ad, you just click on more and then you click on post new ad. Okay, so you can come here and post new ad and you can be selling just like these people are selling here. Okay, for your ad, okay, tips for you to get your ad selling always or ranking first on Binance. It needs to be lower than every other person's own. Your ad, your the amount you're selling or buying needs to be lower than every other person's own. This person is 600, that is why he or she is ranking for. This is 603.30 30 Kobo. That is why this person is ranking more than this person. 
so you must always make sure that you always adjust your ad to be lower than every other person's so because it is very competitive here okay so to be lower than every other person's so, so that you always you know be selling the same thing whether you want to sell or you want to buy you have to just follow those simple strategies and you'll be good to go okay so you come in here click on post ad you can monitor all of your ad by just going to my ad okay um if you want to learn more about the p2p you know you have any question there is um already a p2p trading uh, faq here that you can go through and do understand what is actually going on here okay here on the order you will see all of the orders the ones you've completed the ones that were cancelled you know the ones that are pending all of them you see them under your ad here okay one thing i normally advise people is that if you want to buy or sell crypto here always use the um show only show merchant ads okay these are merchants merchants are the ones who have these verified bashes attached to them and because um they they are always there it has become like a full-time business for many of them so they will always be there to you know reply you the phones are always available for them to sell to you okay any amount you want to buy it is always available to buy from this some of these missions okay so if you want to buy let's say from five million upward you want to sell two million upward and the rest you need to buy from verified mission because they are always the ones who are trading these high volumes of trades on the p2p platform okay so you click on only show us from mission even if you want to sell the same thing only show us from mission and it show you us from missions alone okay so these are people who have been vetted by binance and verified so you can equally trust them now how do you become a merchant on the binance p2p trading platform all you just need to do is to click on this binance user center okay so if i click on the user center it brings us to this interface and when you come in here to this interface you see if you are a verified user it will just go ahead and tell you to become a merchant so if i click on the become merchant it opens up in a new page okay so these are some of the benefit okay you have an advanced um as management okay you have exclusive customer support and then you have these verified badges that i just showed you okay that are attached to your name so with those verified badges people get to trust you and they can buy or sell crypto to you using the binance p2p trading platform okay but you need to meet all of these requirements these three requirements for you to become a binance p2p merchant okay first you need to verify your sms and your email authentication okay the second one is that you need to complete the advanced identity verification the advanced identity verification is the one that requires your you know bank account statement or requires you to upload you know your utility bills and all other stuff that are there okay you can go ahead and go through that okay once you do that then you need to have at least 1000 busd in your spot wallet to be able to become you know a merchant here all right and it is very simple so after that if you meet up all of these requirements just go ahead and click on apply and then binance will vet your account and you know verify your account so the next thing i want to tell you here is that if you buy crypto with the binance p2p platform now binance has different wallet for different purposes okay if you buy p2p on the binance um, um if you buy crypto on the binance p2p trading platform the funds you buy there will be in your funding wallet to be able to use it to either trade features or trade spot, you need to transfer it from your funding wallet to either your features account or your um, your spot wallet. So what I want to show you right now is how to be able to you know transfer those funds to either any other wallet that you want to okay you want to use. All right. So if I come in here to wallet and I go to overview. So once we um, go to wallet and go to overview, it brings us to this page. Okay. So you want to come to spot. Um, let's say you just bought crypto using the P2P platform. So those crypto you bought, all of them, either BTC, um, USDT, BUSD, Ethereum, all of them will be on your funding wallet. Okay, so you want to click on funding wallet. Once you click on funding wallet, let's say you want to use the crypto you bought to trade, you know, um, features or spot. You want to click on it and then click on transfer. Okay, then you can transfer. All you just need to do is toggle this. Okay, toggle this um, arrow here. You want to transfer from funding wallet to your spot wallet, or you select. And once you transfer it to your, you want to transfer from funding wallet to your spot wallet. And once you transfer to your spot wallet, from your spot wallet, you can transfer it to, um, 
your officials account or your margin trading account and then use it to start trading there okay that is how you transfer funds from one wallet to another and if you want to equally sell to your bank account directly let's say the money is in your officials account or your funding wallet or your spot wallet okay let's say it's in your spot wallet you want to equally transfer these funds from your spot wallet to your funding wallet so that you'll be able to assess it on the Binance B2P platform. So I just come in here and click on transfer. Okay, then we can transfer from Sport, um, from Fiat and Sport Wallet. Then we'll just click on this arrow to our funding wallet. Okay, so we can just transfer here to our funding wallet. And then here you select the um, asset you want to transfer. If it is BNB, if it is, you know, USDT, anything at all you want to transfer, you go ahead and, you know, click on it and then click. And confirm your transfer and the funds will be transferred to your funding wallet so once it is transferred to your funding wallet you can come back here again to binance p2p trading and then you now sell that particular asset to your bank account directly all right so one tip i want to leave with you before i leave here is that there's a lot of money you can make you know from the binance um, p2p trading platform all right and one way that i find out that is very true is the binance p2p arbitrage trading option and that arbitrage trading works that you need to have let's say someone in ghana who can be converting your naira to the ghana cities and then use it to buy usdt and forward to you because when they buy usdt in ghana and send to you it is cheaper and then when you sell it in nigeria it is higher so you can always be making profit and so on i have other in-depth videos okay that works you through by uh, uh, how to you know that i carry that in life buying and selling using binance i will leave the links in the video description equally the arbitrage video i equally leave it in the video description you can go ahead and check out those videos and if you do have any issue okay you can always use the comment section and i will always attend to you um to all of your comments all right so that is all i have for you in this video i hope this will help you make use of the binance p2p trading platform and then you know start making money from it while you are buying and selling using this option that is it for this video and i will see you guys in the next video